हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय चैनल एज यू नो आई एव रिटर्न ऑन लारावेल ब्रेपर पैकेज फॉर वन सिग्नल पुश नोटिफिकेशन आई रिसेंटली एडेड न्यू फीचर इनटू टू दी पैकेज हियर इज पैकेज विच इज आई रिटर्न इफ यू आर प्लानिंग टू यूज द वन सिग्नल पुश नोटिफिकेशन इन मोबाइल विथ लारावेल एज अ बैक एंड देन दिस पैकेज इज राइट फॉर यू because you need to call the api for the user device register into the backend and this package provide in built just you need to fire one artisan command for generate the package i already installed this package in this my application and i show you how to generate apis for the user device using one command command given here just need to fire psp partition one signal dot user device colon publish this command generate api controller api repository model and migration as well so let's start just fire this command into the terminal and you can see here i got the information into the terminal user device controller publish and terminal ask for run the migration i specify no and let me show you into the editor and let me open https controller api and user device api controller generated here and let me show you repository here is user device repository generated two functions are there in this repository create or update user device and one function for active and deactive the user device so you can also specify settings in mobile side and active and deactive the notification in your mobile also let me show you the migrations i added the default fields if you want to add more fields you can edit and here also model generated user device dot php and you can use it easily one more thing you need to put this routes into the api dot php so let me open and put it here and one more thing is we need to add is a device controller into the use statement so let me import and add here and one more thing is this uh, register user device api use user id so you need to specify into the auth middleware and you need to use jwt token or anything else for the login let me open this controller and show you update or create functions there into the repository and you can see here the user id get from the login users so you need to use jwt token or laravel sanctum or anything else for the uh, login and put into the auth middleware if you want to see the tutorial how to set up jwt token link given into the description so you can watch it and find it easily so this save your time and you can generate easily with the one command and use it Thank you for watching the video. Please do not forget to subscribe my channel. Thank you.